Okay. All right, Dwayne. Yes, sir. Where are you from? Harrigan. Harrigan, Oregon. Harrigan, Oregon. Harrigan, yeah. What inspired you to come out here? Um, I heard that somebody took over a building down here in Burns at gunpoint, and I wanted to come down and get the real story. And what did, what did you discover when you came down? I, I came down, it was a real peaceful situation. Um, nobody, no maniacs running around with guns all over, shooting or nothing like that. Okay. Yeah. And have buildings been taken over? No. <laughs> no. All right. Did you were you able to get in there? Yeah, yeah. I, I you were. They, they. I went in and they tried to feed me. They did. <laughs> really? Yeah. Uh, nice bunch of people. Uh huh. Um, they just need a solution to this problem. What's the problem? And uh, uh, based on the conversations you were having. Uh, Based on the conversation that I had with everybody, the problem is BLM overstepped their bounds and started taking away from the common ranchers mm -hmm. in the area. And one after one, ranchers went out of business. Yeah. And this is what they've been doing for the last few years. Yeah, you know what I heard? It's interesting. This is, this is uh, I want to convey this to you. I heard that... Uh, since the 1900s, over 100 ranchers have been run off of this land out here. I believe it. Yeah. Um, th these folks are, are being called uh, terrorists. Did you feel like you were, you were having uh, a meal with terrorists? No. They were real nice people, real friendly, mm -hmm. trying to get the real story out there, the real information, the correct information right. to everybody around. Mm -hmm. And uh, they weren't threatening in any way. Um, I I was military for over 10 years. What branch? I was in the Army. You were? Okay. And Ua, I was right? Army, Army it... Scout yeah. all the way. Mm -hmm. um, and I, I couldn't believe that uh, a bunch of people took over a building in my backyard, so I had to come and get the real story. That's right. And that's why I'm here. Based on the people you've met, uh, and uh, and the things that are going on here, do you think that uh, that everyone's on the right side of uh, uh, yes. the 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 law? Uh, I would say enforcing the supreme law, the U.S. Constitution. Do you believe that? I believe that. You do. I believe that something needs to be done and stand up for what is right. And I'm here to do just that. Sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt your interview. That's okay. Go ahead. And, Continue on. And that's why I'm here. I'm a small business owner. I've been to college. Mm -hmm. um, I was in the military. I, I'm a I'm a hardworking American, and I here to show my support for the Hammond family. Excellent. And that's why I'm here. Excellent. So, du Dwayne, Dwayne, Semper yeah. Fi, sir. Army. Thank you. I know. <laughs> what do they say? What do they say in the army? It's good to be home, is what they say in the army. Yes, sir. Thank, thank you, sir. Thank you. What is that truck?